About half of the most productive agricultural land in the Midwest has subsurface drains, also known as tiles. And there are a couple of issues related to that. First is that the, the water carries um, some of the farm nutrients downstream, causing problems. And second is that although there's plenty of water now in the spring, as we move towards the summer, the crops could experience times when they don't have enough water. These issues are expected to become more pressing as future climate change causes more intensive rainfalls and also more prolonged summer droughts. We at Purdue are partnering with researchers from seven other states to investigate three innovative practices that can address these issues. Drainage water management is the practice where we use a water control structure to raise the depth of the drainage outlet, holding water in the fields during the periods when the drainage is not needed. Saturated buffers store water within the soil of field buffers by diverting tile water into laterals that raise the water table. Drainage capture and use, or a practice we also call water recycling, diverts the subsurface drainage water into an on-farm pond or reservoir where it's retained until it can be irrigated back onto the field so that the crop can use it later in the season. Each of these practices has been evaluated at separate locations, but this project will bring all the data together, and this research will help farmers make better decisions as they deal with future climate change and heightened water quality issues.